Hello and welcome back to our YouTube channel. In today's video, we will learn how to integrate WooCommerce to our SurveyMaker plugin. So here you can see that I have a survey and while answering the questions, uh, here I will have a product recommended by the plugin. So here it is. So you will be able to add various WooCommerce products to your SurveyMaker and then recommend them after submitting the survey. So now let's see whether the recommendation will be changed based on my answer. So now let's refresh the survey and pass it again. Let's choose other answers, for example female, very familiar. So here is the second option. Now if you want to create this kind of survey, let's go and see how we can do it together. For that, all you need to do is to have SurveyMaker installed and activated on your WordPress and WooCommerce as well. So first of all, let's go and create our WooCommerce product and then go back to our SurveyMaker. Here, after installing the WooCommerce, you will see that there is another submenu which is called Products. Let's click on it. So here you can see that I have already created various products, but now let's do one together so that you can clearly understand what steps you should do. So for creating a product, first of all, click on the Add New button. So here we are. In the product name, you will be able to write the name of your product so that it would be easy for the users to uh, guess what it is. So in this case, let's write dumbbells. Make sure to not do any misspellings. Here if you have any descriptions, you can write them as well. For example, let's write that it is for um, health and fitness. Uh, this option is responsible for adding the uh, product image. So all you need to do is to click on the set product image button. Uh, here you can upload from your media library and upload files from your device as well. So here we are. Uh, also, the most important part here is that uh, you will need to write the product regular price in this case let it be for example $25 but if you have any sale price you can write it as well after customizing the all needed steps uh, for the final step you will need to click on the publish button so that your product will be created so now if we are moving back to the all products page uh, here we can see that our dumbbells are added so now let's go and see how actually we can integrate it with our survey maker. Now we are moving to the survey maker plugin. Uh, here you know that for creating a new survey you will need to click on the add new button but for saving our time I have already created an example so let's go and see how it works. So this is my survey, here are various sections with questions and with the answers. The most important part here is that for integrating the WooCommerce you will need to make use of the conditional results uh, option. Uh, the conditional results are responsible for creating several conditions and uh, display answers based on them. For so for example you can write any result message so that the users will be get based on the on their answer but for this video we'll make use of the woocommerce tab uh, here you can see that i have already creating created a condition for example i've chosen the questions and uh, then choose the woocommerce product but don't worry, I will show you how you can do it by yourself. Let's scroll a little bit down and here we can see that we have the add condition button. Let's click on it. So here is our blank condition and we can create any kind of condition we want. So here we can see that we have if condition, that is uh, in case for this question, the user chooses this answer and for the second question, the user chooses this answer 
he or she will get this particular result. That is, we can choose this particular product that the user will receive after answering these questions in these conditions. You know that you can add as many conditions as you want based on the number of questions you have. So in this case, we have five questions. We can create five conditions and uh, based on the answers, the user will get its uh, recommended product. So uh, these simple steps are all you need to do for creating a WooCommerce product recommendation survey. Do not forget to click on the save button, otherwise the conditions uh, will not be saved. So now let's go and try the demo version together and see whether we have the same result as it is here. So here we are again. I hope you remember the conditions. So for the first question, we will need to choose the mail option. For the second question, this one. And for the third question, this option. Um, the other answers are not important because we have added the three main conditions. Uh, let's click on the finish button and see what will happen. So here it is. Here is our product recommendation based on the conditions that we have created. So creating a WooCommerce product recommendation survey is even easier with this survey maker plugin. All you need to do is to follow the steps that I told you and now you are free to sell your e-commerce products with the help of this service and which is important, the products will be uh, personalized, that is your users will get any product that they will need at the moment. So I would like to note that the WooCommerce integration is available only in the agency package of the Survey Maker plugin. Besides the WooCommerce integration, there are also various integrations such as Micrate, MailPoet, uh, the ability to create multilingual surveys, uh, text-to-speech option, and ChatGPT integration. Make sure to go and try the new agency package and see what advantages it has.